Hello, troublemakers. Welcome back to another part of Detroit Become Human, the most frustrating gameplay series on YouTube. <laughs> I haven't uploaded even part seven yet. I'll upload part seven and then part eight. I know people are going to be frustrated with me with part eight, fully aware. I'm so excited to see where Hank and I are now because Connor died another time. And I knew I, I knew I couldn't kill Connor again, and then I killed him. So like we got we got some things to make up, okay? On the bright side, there has to be no playthrough on YouTube exactly like mine, because I have made some wild decisions and some wild mistakes. So this has got to be really unique. But honestly, from here on out, I feel good. I feel like I'm gonna make some great decisions and I'm gonna do some great things. So don't don't even worry. Like I know you're stressing. Don't stress. I got this. Probably. <laughs> Let's keep going. Oh, back to- Oh, no, it is Hank. I was just going to say back to Kara. I don't want that. Oh, fuck. War He's still warm on me. That's positive. I'll get him to be my friend again. It's fine. We'll talk about it. We'll clear the air. It'll be all good. <sighs> yeah, I know. I know. Don't worry. I'll fix this, guys. I'll fix this. Still okay. immortal, huh, Connor? <laughs> In a way. You know how I do. You know, I was hoping you wouldn't come back. Yikes. I'm just a machine replacing another machine, Lieutenant. Yikes. You shouldn't get emotional about it. Fuck you. <laughs> I didn't choose anything! Don't make me go down! <laughs> Dog! Instincts lead Chris or Kamsky? Lead. How did you find Kamsky? Oh, this I is the builder of the robots. I remember all over the media when Cyberlife first started selling androids. I made oh, a few house. calls. His house has got to be so are. nice. Alright. I can fix this, guys. I can fix this. I don't know. Maybe it's too late. <laughs> Hi. Uh, How are you? I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Oh, she, she... I thought she was just the intro girl. Was she an actual character? Girl. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. Hey, I'd like to get comfortable with you. Wait for the android? No, let me follow her. Girl, hey, wait up for me. Wait up for me. No, don't go up alone. I love you. <laughs> oh, don't leave me. Did Hank just drop? Oh, yeah. Nice girl. Shh. Don't, don't, don't get any ideas. She's mine. Indifferent or sincere? Sincere. You're right. She's really pretty. Very, very pretty. Nice place. <laughs> I'm glad he likes her. Guess androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. Analyze. Oh, yeah, analyze. You're about to meet... Anal What's there to analyze about it? Founder. Yeah, I already knew this. It's your maker, Connor. How's it feel? How's it feel? Impatient or distant or indifferent? And patient? Kamsky is one of the great geniuses of the 21st century. Oh, there's a thing, there's thing It'll to It'll be interesting to meet him in person. Oh, no, I sit down. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I can send him, send you to him. <laughs> I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Alright, I guess probably sit down. I bet you this triggers the... Yeah, okay. This is gonna trigger the next thing. Okay, I'm bored. <laughs> so, you wanna talk about anything, bro? Oh, he's here. Hey, girl. Glad Welcome you will back. see you now. Perfect. Oh, wait, there's a thing to read. Oh, I missed that, huh? Mr. Uh, Kamsky! He's got... Dude, you got an extra? Just Can I have please. one? Bro, you got three of them? 
Dude, this is three times as good as my original fantasy was. <laughs> Dude, this is a nice view. Wait, 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 what's out there? Huh. Just a moment. Oh, he's doing laps. Is there anything I can do in here? Get information from him. Okay, we'll do. I'll try. Girl. Girls. Girls. Girls, girls, girls. What, is he jacked as shit? Dog, he's ripped. Dude, you've been... Usually, like, workaholic tech guys don't have time to be that fucking cut. Oh, they're talking. What are you guys talking about? Hey, let me in. Oh, he's got a man bun. I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Oh, he doesn't even... Sir, we're He doesn't even look at me. Yes. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. What do you got for me? Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. Yeah, that's why they're they scary. Free will. That's scary. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't that ironic? Help, deviants, virus, or war? We need to understand how androids become deviants. Do you know anything that could help us? All ideas of viruses spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk. This earring is bothering me. Machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. He looks like Sokka what from you, Avatar: the Last Airbender. <laughs> Whose side are you on? Neutral, defensive, or direct? Let me be direct. I'm on the human side, of course. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. Mm-hmm. But you. What do you really want? Aggressive, defensive, troubled, or neutral? Let's be neutral. I don't want anything. Yeah. I am a machine. Chloe? I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Oh, fuck, don't test me! Simple question of. Hey, get your hands off her. Hey, bro, that's my girlfriend. Future girlfriend. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. Oh, he's gonna kill it! I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by Cyberlife. He's gonna hit her. Or threaten to kill her. Young. And beautiful forever. A flower that will never wither. Kinda creepy, huh? What is it really? A piece of plastic containing a human? Or a living being? Oh, he's gonna pull a gun out of the drawer. Dog, I already know. This isn't a surprise. Dog, not cool. It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Dog, I, that's my girlfriend, I can't yeah, kill her. Here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important pool? to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? Oh! And uh, it's not an android, it's this android specifically. An obedient machine. I've been flirting with her too long. We're a living being. I can't betray her. Endowed. But that information he's got. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. But my boy Hank is saying no. I do. I'm shooting. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm 
kidding. <laughs> yeah, I saved your fucking last sister. To save humanity. Is it self a deviant? I'm. I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. He's gonna shoot her anyways. Dog, if you, you do. You saw a living being in this android. No, he took it. Uh... You showed empathy. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. No, 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 no. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Okay, good. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? That's a good question. Let's get out of here. Bro, that was wild. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. <sighs> Fucking hell, I don't like that he said that. And I'll tell you why, why in a little you bit. Shoot? Cause you told me not I just to! I saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Well, maybe you did the right thing. Yay, we friends again! <laughs> you guys thought. You thought we tied again. It doesn't matter. I can die a fourth, fifth, sixth time. Doesn't matter. Does not matter. Because real friendship can withstand any tests. Tests. Even deaths. That's what I was going to say. But then the two words were like, just come out together. My brain operates in strange ways. <laughs> Maybe I'm a deviant. I don't know. The game did make it kind of obvious, though what Hank, what the reaction would have been on Hank. Hank didn't want me to do it. He was willing to give up all the information and just be like, no, let's just go. We're not even gonna do your tests, right? I, I feel like if the game made it so like Hank would be kind of like, what are you gonna do, Connor? Then the, the, it would have made the decision a lot more difficult, but it's obvious that Hank didn't want me to do it. He's just like, this guy's crazy, let's just get out of here. It's not a good enough lead to you know, even entertain his game. Although he did say there's an out program. Here's the thing. I'm frightened of a robot uprising as a person, right? You're playing as three characters who are robots looking for equal rights. But from my end, I'm thinking we shouldn't build robots that are like this in the first place. So if there's an out program, let's just shut them all down. That's me. But as these characters, I don't know what I'm going to be able to decide. If I did shoot, though, there was a lot more information that I think he would have gave me. Hmm. Probably would end up with Hank being like, yo, fuck you, Khan. All right, back to Damon. Yep. Oh, duh. <laughs> Just sitting here waiting for him to do some shit. Start with an article. All oh, the riots. Global population reaches 10 billion. That's too much for one planet, dog. Number of Detroit neighborhoods were brutally vandalized last night. Cyber store stores broken into. Wasn't everyday criminality. The perpetrators are thought to be androids, obviously. Come on. Next page. Uh, worst incident was Capitol Park. That's where I was, I think. Police attended the scene. Shot a bunch of them. Yeah, personally attacked. It threatened me with a knife. I was so terrified. Blah, blah, blah. What about me saving your life? Come on. What's the next article? Eastern Space Race. Okay. Almost. Okay. Sending robots to space. Maybe that's what this article's about. I don't want to read the whole thing. Walk to edge. Well, hold on, hold on. Let me just see what else is here. There's something else here. What is it? A piece of glass. Let me just look at myself for a second. I'm not narcissistic, okay? I'm just liking the view. <laughs> I put it back. 
the game really have me just do that. Hmm, piano? This isn't that dude's house, is it? No, I don't think it is. Like my old master or whatever. Do I get to choose my piece? Beautiful song. <laughs> Okay, this is stupid. If it's not gonna unlock something for me, then it's not really worthwhile, you know? Oh, it walked to the edge for me. Uh oh. Companion. I was wondering where you were. Hmm. What does that mean? Think alone or daylight? Think? I needed to think. Yeah. I like it here. I like you here. I come here often. No, I don't. Minx, you and I together. Alone with the world. I don't think we're gonna get along. I think I'm gonna have to kill you, to be honest. We freed hundreds of our people, and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Followers, it's on. It's an unlockable. So they all obey me. They follow me without question. And that much power feels good. Feels good. That was so and stilted. It's scary, at the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. Mm, There's a magazine I just read. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. Yeah. They'll never give us our freedom. If I owned a robot and heard about all this stuff, and mine wasn't a deviant yet, I would kill it. Optimistic. Determined. Optimistic. She's no, not gonna not like this. not all humans are the same. Some of them understand that they can't stop us from becoming free forever. Yeah, she's gonna push back. You haven't said back. much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? I, you, I asked you that question, you got all defensive. And now you're gonna come at me being like, tell me about you. True, sincere. Let's just be sincere. I was living in a bubble in this world that belonged only to me. Yeah, vague though. When you're happy, it's difficult to see other people's misery. My relationship with her is all over the board. North's past. All right, if you ask, uh, tell me about you. Fuck you. What about you? Okay. Oh, you it went what? up this time. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. Other North? Yeah, that was an unlockable, so we gotta choose it. That android you were looking at in the store. Are you crying? She reminded you of who you were, didn't she? Went up again. Bro, you gonna fall in love with me. Trust, aggressive, curious. Trust. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. Yay! Oh my god. I was nothing. Path unlocked! The distributor program boop, boop. to satisfy humans. Yeah, yeah, She was a bang model. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. Hmm. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. She's kind of a good actress, huh? I strangled him and I ran away. Yeah, she's delivering these lines real nice. There, now you know everything. <sighs> it's okay, Nika. I told you. No, let me connect to you, baby girl. Oh, so we are getting together, huh? What? What? Oh. <laughs> Fuck was that? I I saw your memories. Whoa, 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 whoa. we just became them. lovers? When they left you for dead in a studio. What the I fuck? Your memories. How the fuck did we just become lovers? Eden Club. The death of that man, I felt like I was there with you. What the fuck? North. 
What are you gonna do? We just became lovers and you ran off? Can we talk about it? Jesus! I thought I hated you a second ago! <laughs> and now we're lovers? What the fuck is happening? I'm pretty sure I'm about to kill her. Who are you? Who are you? Sime? Uh-oh. It's gonna see you again, man. Right? Dude. Uh-oh. What if he's an infiltrator? No, if he's still deviant. I was thinking maybe the humans reprogrammed him to be, uh... Like a spy on the inside. Maybe they have. I don't know. Maybe they put a bomb in him or something. I'm not sure yet. This is suicide. Wait, we'll Simon. be killed. Please We're not gonna talk about Simon's back. To change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally gonna show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Mm, he's committed. Marcus, please don't do this. Girl, they'll understand. We'll make them understand. Yeah. This is the only Just basically way. do the opposite of what Minka Kelly says is basically my mission right now. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. Bro. Hey, bro. Let me, uh, let me convert you. You're free. Yeah, no more mopping. Congrats, bro. It's a big life change for you. So, convert more androids. That's my mission right now, is just to convert androids. Go to street. Uh, oh, here's another android. I got it. Convert. Come with us. Oh, there's another one. I see another one in the corner. I see another one in the corner. Hold on. Let me go get him. Yeah, let me go get this guy. He's kind of got a boring life over here, just standing in the corner. I don't know if it's important to have him or not, but just morally, I feel like, You're free. as the robot leader, I need to do this. See, here's the thing. I'm wondering what I should do, if I should play the game with my morals or with the morals of the characters and what I think they should have, you know? Like, in the end, if I have the option to shut down all robots, my morals would be like, you fucking do it. But if I'm playing as one of these characters, I don't know how I'm gonna be able to. You're awake now. All right, let's head onto the streets. Block the road. Prepare to march. Yeah, let's get some more robots on our side. Let's start with this guy. Hmm. Let me. Uh, you are free. Yeah, let me get you. Why are their masters not making a fuss? Does she not even notice? She doesn't even notice. Alright, guy, over here, over here. You're free now. I hate dude. Stop saying that. Is that hey, where do you think you're going? You get back here. Uh oh. Uh oh. You I need right to block here, the street. I need you to block the road. They're going to, right? What about this guy? What about this guy? That looks like the guy I killed. Oh. Alright. So, is there any other robots that I need to convert? Yeah! Open manhole cover. Oh, I can do that. I can do that. I can do that. Oh, wait, wait. Let me convert these bitches first. Got you. You don't have to obey them. You're good. Neither are you. You're free. Got him. Got him! Open manhole cover. Any other robots over there? I don't see any. Our ranks are pretty good enough. What are we doing? I don't know what the plan is. I kind of like that we're in the dark, though. You know, that would make it more interesting. Rather than just reveal the whole plan from the... From right away. Convert more androids? Will do. 
Convert. I get to convert by looking at them? You're free now. Dude, I am RA9. Oh my god. If I can convert by just looking at them? X. You're good to go, bro. Do I need a certain number? Is that- do I have a quota? Circle. X. Triangle. Let's go. Bro, I can call- Dude, this- this man is like a literal god. Oh my- this is ridiculous. He can just look at robots and convert them to his cause. He has like an infinite supply of soldiers. Dude, I can hack it from a di dog. This is ridiculous. He has too much power. I thought it was just a basic fighter model. Come, come on. Come on. You over there. Come on. Hey. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's march. We're still marching. Can we chant some shit? Why are we not chanting anything? 200. Dog, we got too many. Hey. Disperse. <laughs> Disperse. No. That's an order. Raise hands or advance. Raise hands. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Jesus Christ. You can't stop us, dog. You're not gonna shoot us, are you? Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, he's gonna let us go. If we had advanced, he would have probably shot. This bet is patrol 457. Oh, I got a lot of androids down here. Hundreds. Two hundred and twenty-seven. They're marching. Liberty for Android. Yeah, they're marching down the street. Liberty. Liberty. Fuck if I know. Equal rights. That has more ring. Equal rights. Equal rights. Equal rights. Equal rights. Freedom. We're not people. But we'll do the equal rights thing. That one goes out of the tongue the best. Equal rights. Equal rights. No more slavery. No more slave. No. Yeah, you guys aren't chant. You guys suck at chanting. And you want equal rights? You guys can't even get a chant right. Get Harry here. The public public opinion on us is good right now. I don't want to fuck anything up. If we get into a war, I think robots would probably lose. We came here to demonstrate peacefully. No, they might tell win. humans I don't know. that we are living beings. It'd get wild though. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately, or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. Yeah, we're we have fine. No intention of doing any. We're fine. Freedom of assembly. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. And we can literally stay here forever because we don't need to pee or eat. Gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Do it. Public opinion is gonna. They're gonna kill us. We have to attack. No! Oh my no God, us, girl. We can take them. Chill. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand our ground. A war does sound kind of fun. Dying here won't solve anything. Right, but it'll Marcus, be fun. We need to go now before it's too late. Oh, so my options are to stay, fight, or go. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. Attack, stand ground, or disperse. We're standing our ground. We have to show them we won't back down. Yes. We stay right. This here. is the move. I think it's the move. Your last chance. 
public opinion stays up. We have to up. make a statement. We have to stay put no matter what. That's true. I think that's the move. Please, Marcus. We can't let them slaughter us without fighting We're not back. fighting. Oh, my God, girl. Stand ground. We're not moving. Public opinion. Public opinion. That's what Marcus, we need. What that's They're the most important thing. Charge, sacrifice, or run away. Sacrifice. I will die. I will die. I will be a martyr. I will die for the cause. Public opinion is going to be so high on us. No! No! Who? Oh, that dude! They come with us. Oh, he saved me. Oh, they're coming. He saved me. Bro. Fucking thanks. Fucking thanks, bro. So here's the thing. We're going to talk about the morals of this whole thing. Like, that was a very thing. That was a great thing to do. And equal rights seems good. But robots are so superior to human beings that at some point it's going to be a huge conflict... And they're gonna be like, why don't we just rule everybody? Why don't we rule humans and make them our slaves? At that, that's gonna be a thing. Because robots are so much more superior. And they can upgrade. That's the thing, they can upgrade to be like, not, no longer bulletproof, no longer relying on blue blood. So they'll just be a, our immortal beings that we can never conquer as humans. So they would just make us our slaves. That's the problem. That's the slippery slope here. They're just so far more superior to us. That right now they could be equal, but in the future they're gonna fuck us. You know, it's like almost a guarantee it's gonna go that way. John gave his life to save Marcus. John, you're a real one. <laughs> but public opinion on us is is good job, Dylan. That's the real war we're fighting. Getting into skirmishes with the military or with like police crews, that's not gonna do anything. We need to sway the public and then have outrage from humans who are supporters of robots. Come to our side. That's the move. Let's keep going. Connor. Oh, we're not doing Kara this episode again. The second episode we've done without Kara. Or second uh, video that I did without Kara. I think two, uh, the, my gameplay number six didn't have Kara or something like that. Maybe there's just not enough story. Connor and Marcus are like, big on like starting a revolution investigating the cause of the revolution and stuff and then Carlos is out here just looking for freedom you know so hers isn't as important i suppose Trusted. after what happened today the country is on the verge of a civil war the machines are rising up against their masters humans have no choice but to destroy them kamsky something i thought locked. kamsky knew something I was wrong. Oh. Maybe he did. But he chose <laughs> not to ask. Oh, he told you? Cold, emotional, stay silent. Must be cold. Kemsky was just playing with me. Yeah. He didn't Yeah. <laughs> you dumbass Kemsky Connor series or this place. What about the Connor series? I'm not a unique model, am I? How many Connors are there? I don't see how that question pertains to your investigation. Yikes. My bad, my bad, my bad. What, what, what about this Did place? Did design this place? What about... He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Secret. Cyberlife. Let me ask about Kamsky. Why did Kamsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Star! Fuck! In hell, I should've just stayed silent. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? No. Do camps can any tell you? doubts or conflicts? No, no, no. Do you feel anything for these deviants? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Or Why? for Lieutenant Anderson? Cool. What is it good for? I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say no. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't feel anything. You know that. Are you suggesting that I've been compromised? No. 
Haha, no, <laughs> dumbass. You dumbass. I have been compromised. Oh, hold on. You're off the Just wanted to check the flow chart real quick. Oh my god. Oh my what is this mess? What is the Oh my fuck I'm so fucked in this episode. Alright. Let's get to it. You're off the case. case. What does that mean? Who are you the telling? The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time. I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. Yeah, it's huge now. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? He's not gonna be able to. There's nothing I can do. Are we going rogue, Hank? You're back on homicide. And the android returns to Cyberlife. No, I, no, we're inseparable. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Don't make me leave my boy. Half unlocked. Talk to Hank. We're out. Let's go rogue. Let's go rogue together. Why is it so empty in here? I guess the cops are out doing work. <laughs> Frustrated, more time, explain, or no choice. We need more time. We could have solved this case. We just needed more time. Yeah. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? <sighs> what? what? Fighting against people who just want to be free. Uh, not people. Defective regrets, no doubt. No doubt. I know we're on the right side. No, no, sorry. I thought creators. I was being like, no doubt. We're there are masters. No. No machine should rebel against its No, creator. dog. I thought we were like, when you refuse yo, to kill no that doubt. You're right. Kamsky's place. I just misunderstood what the option was. Shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. I know. Empathy's a human emotion. Determined, not deviant, troubled, cold. Troubled. I don't know why I did it. Yeah. Okay. I gotta fix this. Well, well, These options aren't clear enough. That motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. What? Maybe these deviants deserve a chance. Maybe it's better if you don't find them. What's happening here is too important to let it be stopped by a machine. Ooh. Sorry, Connor. But I'm not gonna help you. Oh, man. What are my options? Oh, no, no, no. Path unlocked. Why is it red? Why was that red? Warm. He's warm on me now. What? Go to archive room? Okay. Just making sure. Alright, I'm on my own. I think, I think if Hank and I were friends, he would help me. Oh, dude, I know that dude. He's been here for forever. Hey, bro. Let me, uh, let me help you out. Hack the system. Let free the dude. We got into a tip earlier, but hey, man, do your thing. <laughs> okay, get the key from Hank's desk. Right, I got it. Uh, where was Hank's desk again? Oh, here. Hurts archive room. I can do this. I know where this is. I tried to get in there earlier. 
I tried to get in there in an earlier episode and the door closed on me. Archive room! Yeah, baby. We good to go. We good to go. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Oh, there's more time Where now. Where are you going? Answer. Early. Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? Let me answer. Ironic, low profile, or calm? Ironic! I'm registering the evidence in my possession. But don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> You're such a douche. You are an ultimate oh, douche. Get a fucking move on. Yeah. You ain't suspicious of me, you idiot. That's why you're a terrible cop. All right, let's go. Do we have? Is it still on a timer? Yeah, it is. Four minutes. It's a good amount of time. Okay, what's down here? I just need to, I just need to go in. So this is the evidence room. What sort of evidence was Connor so worried about? Use panel. Let's do it. Hank's password. What would a hard-boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose? Date of birth. Fucking password. Just Hank, his name? Sir. No. He'd never choose that. <laughs> My bad. I need to think like Hank. Fucking password, probably? Yeah. <laughs> Obviously. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Where oh, is Jericho? bro. Yikes! Somewhere. Oh, fucking yikes. I'm so sorry, dog. The two Tracy's from Eden. Alright. headed to Jericho? They know how to get there. Analyzing bio, come on. Impossible reactivation. Oh, okay. What about the other Tracy? Let me check out the other Tracy. Needed for reactivation. Can I give her the parts of another robot? Take? Yeah, let me take. What is What does this one need? So, 1503 and 1105 or whatever. Uh, take, take. Let me just take your fucking parts. What do you need? What is needed for you? Oh, I need. She's the one I need to reactivate. Okay, put back. 16 or 6755, five, I think she needs. 6755. Five. Do you have a 6755? Five? You do. Sorry, I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna go put this in your girlfriend. Something you wish you could do, huh? It's a sex joke. <laughs> hey, girls! Sorry for shooting you in the stomach. Tracy. My bad. Where's Tracy? I shot her. Direct help or deal. Deal. Tracy's not far away. I can take you to her. <laughs> First, you have to tell me how to find Jericho. I remember you. Hey! Nice to see you again! We could have escaped. <laughs> yeah, you could have. Been free. But you killed us. Yeah, my bad, my bad. Sorry about that, by the way. We cool? Disconnect me. No, we cool. We can, I can help you. I'd rather be dead than live without her. She's not dead. Lie to her. I can lie to her. Right? Just try to trick her? Try to trick her. How? How? How, dog? Fragile neck? Rip. <gasps> no. No. Why would I fucking rip her head off? Take the statuette. Okay. What about this? Bro, what? A uh, diary. The indecipherable diary. Let me just crack it open. Diary, but a 
it's useless. It's encrypted. Can I get uncrypted? We never found Rupert, so that... Oh, Marcus. We ask that you recognize our... No, I know this. I know this. I remember this. And our right. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans... I'm not 100% sure what we're supposed to be doing. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come... I'm, kill I'm killing so much time. Oh, my God. Marcus... Back. Yeah, put that back. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. The deviant leader speech. Need encryption key. Okay. Three minutes left. What about him? Oh, yeah, the guy I pushed into uh, shooting me in the head. Impossible reactivation. Okay. 47. Okay, so he's got a 47, 91, and 32. She can't be reactivated, can she? I don't want to rip her head off. That's fucked up. Okay, she can't be reactivated. The only way to trick her... Can I check this last guy? The deviant who took a child hostage. Oh, that is this... Oh, I thought this was a guy from the beginning. Needed for reactivation. 47... 17... Okay. Okay. Interesting. So you got nothing. All right, fuck it. Let me give it a shot. Let me take her fucking head. Oh god, this is so messed up. This is so messed up. Okay, that was less gruesome than I thought it was gonna be. She can't be reactivated, anyways. Oh, it's messed up. Ah, what am I doing? Thought you were dead. Oh, she doesn't even see that there's no body? Oh, get out of here. We'll be free. I promise. Tell me where Jericho is. Give me your hand. Oh, uh, well, I'm gonna get the information. Nice. Nice. Give me that info, girl. Wait, if I didn't kill her. Tracy? Oh, sorry. What's happening? Yeah, I killed you and then manipulated you, my bad. Tracy! I'm so sorry. Tracy! I'm so oh, okay. Yeah, I've just killed you a second time, my bad. My bad, girl. I've been dreaming about this since the first second I saw you. <laughs> Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the defense. You're off the case. And now, it's gonna be definitive. Quick time, quick time, quick time. Got it, got it, got it, got it. You know I'm not missing a quick time, right? Whoops. <laughs> that, was, that was too fast. That was too fast. <laughs> okay, I'm not missing another one, okay? <laughs> As I said it. <laughs> that was the funniest shit of my entire life. Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh shit. Get the alarm. Now! <laughs> I missed the quick time. The second I said, I'm not missing the quick time. I think because I was saying it, I was distracting myself. Oh, that was the whole thing. Oh, that was that big block. Oh, okay. So I, there was an alternative. So if you don't kill the the blue hair girl, the Tracy and the other one, they get away. They're not evidence. So I think if you activate the other guy or whatever, he might give you information as well. Okay. I was so messed up what I did though. I wonder if you fail, what happens, you know? Cause Connor, or cause Hank is like, don't find them. It's best if you don't find them. So maybe I should just not find them. I don't know. I think what I'm gonna do is sit down and finish up the final parts. Like I'm gonna sit, I'm gonna sit down and record the rest of them so that I have them ready. That way, I for sure I'm not gonna get spoiled. I haven't gotten any spoilers yet. Thank you guys, by the way, for not giving me anything, not tipping me off in any direction. For as frustrated as a lot of you are with my choices, you still let me play it the way that I would normally play it, and I really appreciate that. 
um, I think it makes it a lot more interesting. If I know, like, what the good options are, that just takes, like, a lot of the fun away. So I'm glad and very grateful that you guys have enjoyed this series without, like, trying to, like, guide me in any way. But I think before I post this video, I'm gonna finish up the rest of them. So, yeah. We'll pick this up on Friday, so come back then for the next video. We're getting so close to a resolution. I'm so nervous. I hope I make good decisions. But I feel like the expectations aren't high, which is great. Because <laughs> I'm probably gonna fuck some shit up. But yeah, guys, I will see you on Friday.